This is a microbot. Actually, um, yeah, wrong movie. So this is a 3D printed dummy 13. And what exactly is a dummy 13? It's a 3D printed action figure. It's one of the most famous online. There's tons of videos out there of like hundreds of thousands and even millions of views about just 3D printed little toy. It's designed by Shu Labs or something. Shu Fu, I, I don't know, but designed by some people. I'm gonna put it, you know, yeah, never mind. Um, yeah, this is one of the coolest 3D printed action figures you can 3D print, mainly because you could actually 3D print accessories. The community is very good. They have shoes that you can put magnets in and swords and anime stuff. It's just awesome. So yeah, that's why 3D printing dummy 13s are cool. But someone asked me to do it. That's why I'm doing it. And I figured, hey, I'm not a below average guy. So uh, I'm gonna print it bigger. So let's talk about the initial hurdles I faced when starting this project. First and foremost, sourcing materials was a huge challenge. I needed something that would be strong enough to hold the shape but also light enough to be easily maneuverable. I spent hours researching different materials. Just kidding, I'm broke. I used what I have, some PETG and PLA. The design of my dummy was a major hurdle. Actually, it was pretty easy. I got my files off of Maker World and I just adjusted the settings. First and foremost, what I did do was I changed the printer settings from the AU1 to uh, I think the P1S. Then I chose a filament that I'd want to use, and um, I had PETG translucent and some PLA matte. The reason I don't have both PETG is because the PLA is going to be used for support, and it just helps remove the support so much easier. It does take a little bit more time, like maybe 30 minutes, but it's not that bad. And I went to the support settings, and you're going to want to change the default to support to PLA. And then you're going to want to change the top Z distance to zero and the bottom Z distance to zero. This is one of the prints that took less time. Most of these prints took over three hours. Some took eight, some took nine, and some took 12. But um, yeah, it was a lot of printing time. After slicing all the files, I got to printing. Then I started removing all of the prints from the print beds, which took a while, but it was super satisfying. It came off super nicely because the PLA was in between the PTG supports and the print itself, and it only done like one or two layers and it just worked awesome. It came off very easily.
Normally, you 3D print these dummy 13s in these kit cards, so you can just print and then take off the plate. You usually print these in two kit cards, one for the body and one for the mainframe, and then you put them all together, the legs, the chest, the head, and everything. And this is the actual scale of the dummy 13. I 3D printed it way larger. You just, just watch me assemble it. Can I even get this thing to stand up? That's the problem because it's so heavy I'm not sure if it can stand up. Let's hope this doesn't fall over. Break. Oh no, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, naughty, naughty. Stay up, big. Stay up. Stand up. No, no, collapsing at the knees. 
day before knee surgery. Come on. Come on, you can't be like this. Hold tight, hold. You got this. Nope, keep your legs straight. No. No, no, no. Yes, I have done it. Yes. We are good. Also, one more problem with this dummy 13. Let me set it up. Like, it's fallen over because of friction, but I printed some weapons for it. Kind of like this epic Halo gun blaster. I don't know the name of okay, okay, I love Halo, but I haven't played in a while. Turn your hand. Like, uh... Move all the fingers and it just drops, the thick frictioning enough. The saying is true, the bigger they are, the harder they fall. And this is kind of falling hard. It don't hold its weapon. But the good news is, I printed some extra hands because I figured they'd come in handy. Come in handy. <laughs>